guys, we've arrived here at Marham, at the Circo paint shop, to pick up the Harrier. First impressions, wow, this thing is absolutely stunning. Most immaculate aeroplane I've ever seen. Pressure's on a little bit because we've got to get this back without any scuffs or scrapes or contact with any tree branches. Uh, what we're going to do is treat this with kid gloves. We've ordered an extra large quantity of uh, carpet and underlay, uh, lots of cotton wool, lots of bubble wrap. Uh, you can hear behind me the, uh, the guys with the crane lorries have turned up and uh, we're going to start loading the fuselage in the wing and then we're going to pack up all the smaller items like the drop tanks that you can see behind me and all the panels and parts, they're all going to be packed and put away. We're going to crack on now, we've got a lot to do in a very short space of time to do it in. So we're going to start loading the aircraft now, the fuselage and the wing and then all the component parts. We're going to get it all loaded up and transport it back to Yorkshire, hopefully before it gets dark. I'll shoot lots more video and take lots of pictures and uh, hope you enjoy this little video we made for you. Okay guys, it's the end of day two and it's mission accomplished. We've got XV741 safely back to Jet Art. The aeroplane's now tucked up in the warm and the dry, all unloaded. We got the aeroplane back here without scratch, which was the whole aim of the exercise. And we're now gonna spend the next few weeks and months finishing this project off. We're going for a well-deserved beer now, but we will keep you guys informed of uh, how the restoration progresses over the coming weeks and months. Thanks for watching, catch you later. And all the panels and parts, they're all going to be packed and put away. And as you can see, behind me we have our two fine quality crate drivers. Yeah, good lads. And Right guys.